Hey everybody, Scott Patello, broker owner of Home and Key Real Estate uh, in downtown New Bedford. Uh, just wanted to shoot a quick video. Um, one of the most common questions that I get asked is how did I end up in the real estate business? I would love to give you this very sexy story of why I wanted to get into real estate, but the reality is, the truth is, I wanted to get out of prison more than I wanted to get into real estate. And no, by the way, I wasn't living in prison, but I was working in one. So when I was 19 years old, uh, I started working as a correction officer uh, at a state prison. And it only took me a few years to realize that's not really something I wanted to do for the remainder of my life. And you know, I really didn't know what else to do. Um, but a couple things kind of fell into place and opened it up for me. Uh, Number one, I had an opportunity to watch my ex-father-in-law. He had been in the real estate business for 30 plus years at that time. <clears throat> and I was watching what he was doing. And I was thinking, I, I, I think I could really do this. So that was number one. But probably more importantly than that, uh, a few years prior to getting uh, involved with real estate, I was introduced to network marketing. And the main piece, the reason why I bring that up, is with that came an introduction to personal development. That's what changed my entire life. Um, I talk about it all the time. I, I really uh, emphasize that to all my agents that work here. Um, you know, I got introduced to people like Jim Rohn, Les Brown. Uh, said, hey, you can have more of everything you want. All you have to do is become more. Um, work hard on yourself, then you're doing your job. All these different things. And so I got introduced to that stuff in probably 1995. And I've been a student ever since. It's something I do every single day. Um, I start my day out every single morning with that stuff and then throughout the day as well. So that was a big thing. But, you know, something happened. When I wasn't able to, you know, I thought that network marketing was going to be my ticket out of the prison, right? Um, because, in fact, the guy that sponsored me into that business, he was a captain at the prison. He quit to do that full time. And his sponsor was another correction officer at the prison, and he quit that to do it full time. So I was the next logical one to go. Um, something happened, things fell apart. Uh, that's a whole nother story. Uh, but that's what led me to real estate because I continued to watch my ex-father-in-law at the time. And like I said, I said, geez, if I can uh, talk on the phone with people and I can drive around, I can do this business forever. And I, I, you know, I had understood all the sales stuff from the network marketing piece in terms of laws of averages and, and all that good stuff and having the right mind frame. So that's how I really got involved with real estate. Um, Fell in love with it, and 20 some odd years later, here I am. So, um, but that's how I got, like I said, not a big sexy story, but it's the truth. So, anyway, anybody got any questions of, you know, how to get into the real estate business, feel free to reach out to me. You can always reach me on my cell at 508 789 8529. Oh, here's a little treat for you before I go. So, there is me as a young man with hair. Um, I started my, my career at Townhouse Realty, which is a small, uh, independent brokerage in Dartmouth. In fact, that sign that I was standing in front of actually is the current Remax Vantage sign. Um, that's where I started over there. So it's kind of funny how things have uh, evolved over the year. Uh, less hair, a little older, uh, a little bit more experience. But again, hey, if you got any questions about a real estate career, feel free to reach out to me. 508-789-8529. Um, Talk to you soon.